What's going on guys? Killer6 back with another Borderlands 3 legendary item guide video for you and this time we're taking a look at the bankrolled predatory lending SMG. The predatory lending is a legendary Hyperion SMG and the red text reads bullets are cheap but not that cheap which near as I can tell is just reference to how this gun works but more on that in a second. Now I'm pretty sure that this gun always spawns with the exact same name and never a prefix but I've only gotten it twice so I could be wrong. The level 7 stats are 7 damage, 57% accuracy, 66% handling, 3.1 second reload time, 10.5 fire rate per second, and a mag size of 66. Additional stats are 21% critical hit damage, 21% weapon damage, and 44% weapon shield capacity. Now speaking of, since this is a Hyperion, it features the new Hyperion gimmick of having a shield projection in front of you anytime you aim down sights. So what does this gun do? Well, it charges you money to shoot it. <laughs> Straight up. Every bullet you shoot is $1 in the game. <laughs> this reminds me of the uh, charge weapons from Fantasy Star Online, a game that I loved back in the day. And that gun did basically the same thing, but it would give you a huge damage bonus. Whereas this gun does not give you any kind of bonus for spending your money. <laughs> I do love how you can see the dollar signs pop up when you hit your shots and how the mag size turns into however much cash you have on that character. So that's pretty cool. So how do you get this gun? The Predatory Lending is a rare drop from Lavender Crawley in the Droughts. You can actually encounter this enemy on your first time through the game and they do spawn 100% of the time. If you uh, look on screen right here, you'll see the route that I take in order to get there each time. You'll have to whittle Lavender down to the point where it pods up and splits into two other Crawly named enemies. Eventually one of the Crawlies will hopefully drop this for you. I got mine on about the 12th run, so if I had to guess I'd say it's probably about a 10% drop chance, but I'm not 100% certain on that. So is this gun worth getting? Well, it's very gimmicky and it's probably best to be only used if you have a lot of extra cash on your character. Even then I feel like there's probably a lot better options out there in terms of SMGs. That said, I love to collect loot, so I will probably farm this at some point occasionally. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then please take a second to hit that like button, hit subscribe, and tap the bell icon to be notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all take care.